You know, we're always on the lookout for places where you find a good meal, but sometimes you also have to satisfy your sweet tooth, right? It, that's right. In tonight's Dine and Dish, Action News anchor Dale Wrong joins us after making dessert his first course of the day. <laughs> Dale? That's right, Margo and Warren. Pastries, cakes, and cookies deserve equal treatment, don't they? We dropped in on a longtime Fresno favorite, Eddie's Bakery Cafe, to see what's in the oven. It is the best of both worlds, fresh fruit and cake. One of the most popular items at Eddie's Bakery in Northeast Fresno is the Niswa cake. Their joy, so it's a great feeling when you see that you've made someone happy. So many sweet choices as you scan the display case, but you really can't make a bad one. I'm really excited. The employees are really nice and uh, come here all the time. This is a Mother's Day and, uh, you know, July 4th, our birthday, my kids are coming all the time. Like artists, Julie Flowers and the crew work their magic behind the scenes, shaping, coloring, decorating desserts. Items, I mean, if we're counting individual cupcakes in the thousands with cake, I mean, we make a lot of items every day. Single de Mayo cookies for my grandson and these uh, bear claws for my mom. Cookies shaped like tacos and churro cupcakes were among the holiday treats. That's a churro. But Flowers said I also had to try the margarita mousse, which comes with salt around the rim of the cup. Ooh, that's good. To meet the daily demand, Eddie's has six bakers baking long before the shop opens at six in the morn. Our ovens are certainly going almost, you know, 12 to 15 hours a day. That freshly baked bread doesn't appear by magic. Some people might not realize you can also have lunch here. I get the BLT. Yeah, and it's really, really good. The number one item, though, is the pink champagne cake. It's got a Bavarian custard filling with a champagne extract. People will come in and, and ask. If they don't see him, they'll ask because this is no, they know this is their home. Eddie Reidenhauer opened his business in 1939. Subsequent owners sought consistency for customers coming here a long time. I don't want to say because I never say my age. Um, I guess 40 years. We try to stay as true to the Danish recipe that's been passed down from the original owner. Eddie's Bakery Cafe now preparing for Mother's Day because mom, of course, is the sweetest. Of course. Mom should get, should get one of those margarita <laughs> mousses. There. Those look pretty good. Yeah, they were pretty good. I'll it's take funny two. because at, at, at that place, it, it makes you feel, even if you're an adult, like you're a kid because you're walking around saying, I need that. Oh, yeah. One of those. Mm -hmm. Two of cookies. those. They yeah. are really are a present yes. institution. Yeah. For I sure. have fond childhood memories there. <laughs> <laughs> and adult memories. Yeah, <laughs> many of those. Many of those, too. All right. <laughs> Dale, okay. thanks again. Uh -huh. Thank you for watching. For more videos like this from ABC 30, just make sure to hit that subscribe button below.